welcome to my vlog. This is still a continuation to the fourth chase series. Um, it's Sunday morning at Musenberg. Very cloudy. The tide is out. <laughs> um, so yeah, so today is the D-Day. It's audition day. And um, so yeah. So I'm back here to meet up with um, Nikki. There's another Nikki. And um, she's going to be somewhat of an advisor during my rehearsal period just to someone to bounce off ideas like we used to do a long time ago. We go way back, we've acted before at the Mars Theatre. Um, yeah, so also another reason why I'm here is because the print shop did not print all the scenes that I need for the audition material. So I'm hoping that there's a pharmacy in Musenberg that is open and is able to um, who's able to print yeah, so um, holding thumbs we are at the audition place it's the guide hall there goes Barry <laughs> Barry <Hi. laughs> um, the pharmacy did not have uh, a printer to, to print my um, audition stuff so that was a major fail but I met up with Nikki Hudson so we are now waiting at the rehearsal well audition venue and see if everyone arrives 10 minutes to go 10 minutes to go eating our lunch before fortifying <laughs> ourselves for the hard task of determining whether someone's actually going to make it on stage or not <laughs> check you out later bye, bye. <laughs> So I have come back from auditions today um, it was quite an experience, it was actually quite nerve-wracking to be honest with you, um, to have people looking at me <laughs> thinking I know everything but I actually don't. But anyway, not the point. Um, it was a great experience, I really really enjoyed myself, it was such a learning curve. I had Barry on my side who <laughs> really really helped as well as Daniel and the two Nickies. Um, the only sad thing about um, today's audition was that there wasn't a lot of people. There were four people in general and the cast is needing of eight people. Um, there were two guys and two girls and they were both wanting the same role so it was like okay that's cool but I, I need more variety or more things to look at to make a, a conscious decision of who's going to play who. So, I'm holding more auditions. It's going to be happening next week, Sunday. So, hopefully, a lot more will be there. Um, what I'll have to be doing is stalking people in the theatre world and convince them to come and audition for me. And hopefully, we will get a cast. And hopefully, start our rehearsals in September. So, let's just hold hopefully whole thumbs so yeah right it's been a week since um, the auditions I'm holding some today hopefully more people would have arrived and hopefully I will get the, the show casted um, got some more emails during the week so yeah looking good I have come back from the second audition for four chairs um, Unfortunately, the venue was double booked, so we held it outside before the rain came. Uh, a few new faces arrived. Um, I expected more, I'm sorry, I just expected more. But luckily enough, um, thank you Barry for allowing me to do and finish my auditions at your place. It was very, very nice and cosy. Um, there are a few people there who really impressed me. Um, some who were there the previous week. Um, Stop saying them. Yes, I know that. That's We've just come back from an audition. Yes, we just, come, we just came back from the auditions for um, Four Chairs. It was the second audition. There were a lot more people than I had last time and some did return. There were some girls who read for the parts, which they were really, really, really good. So um, we did have an issue with regards to the venue for the auditions, but we luckily managed to go to Barry's house and he was a gracious host 
and uh, we had a little discussion after the audition had finished. So I do have a cast. I'm just missing one, which we can cast at a later stage. It's not uh, a huge issue. He would have a little small role in the show. So hopefully the next time you will see me, it will be at the first rehearsal. Hello, I'm Wayne and welcome to my vlog. I have cast all the characters in my play Four Chairs, so that's pretty exciting and rehearsals can be happening soon. I have come to realize that maybe I might not need someone to sing the songs between the scenes as I wanted, wanted to do so earlier on in the previous videos. But things might change. I think um, we adapt while we go along. So, I haven't done a video for Four Chairs for a while now. It's been two weeks since I started with rehearsals. Um, one of my guys have dropped out due to creative differences, which is quite weird being that this is a community theatre production. So, yeah, so he has gone and I have replaced him with another guy that was already casted for another role. But it's good to go. Um, Another thing that has popped up now is that one of my actresses have also dropped out due to family commitments, which I could understand. And I'm hopefully going to see one of them today and hopefully get that role casted, in a sense. I'm huffing and puffing because I'm late for a rehearsal due to uh, Metro Rail. And Nikki, the stage manager, has just had an issue at home, so I don't know where she is at the moment, so... We might even have rehearsals outside. <laughs> right, I am obviously doing another video and I haven't actually kept you up to date on what's been happening. Um, the last video that I shot was at least <laughs> three weeks ago and I haven't done any footage for um, from our first rehearsal, let alone any other rehearsal that we've had. Um, it's been a very tiring time. Um, so yeah, it's been a very, very busy learning and new stuff and what have you. Um, in the last video, you heard that I was going to see this new person to be casted. Um, that fell through after two days. She had work commitments and, which is understandable, she works in, in, in wardrobe of sets of movies and TV series. So. She has long hours and I didn't want her to burn herself out because she'll be going from work and then to rehearsal. So that was okay. Um, and then I joked with my cast members if there was any of their mothers who were willing to play the role and one actually said yes. And he brought his mother to the rehearsal and I really, really loved her. She is very natural. And um, it's going to be weird because he's now going to be acting opposite his mom. Not a lot of people have that opportunity these days to actually perform on stage with their mother. So that's pretty exciting. Um, so yeah, that's, <laughs> that's basically it now. As you can see, I've got bags under my eyes. Um, it's just been a very long, stressful few weeks due to exams but that's not your problem um, catch you on the flip side